The Chiefs Kingdom can cast its vote at Arrowhead this year. Pretty strange, right? Yeah. 2020, cool though. At the same time. <laughs> KCTV 5 Savannah Rudisell is explaining the details of all of this. So, Savannah, how are they going to turn mm -hmm. Arrowhead from a game day experience Sunday to a place where you vote? Yeah, Kelly, and after uh, the fans clear out from the Jets game on Sunday, they're going to start prepping the stadium and getting ready for a voting location kind of experience. Two very different things. It's all going to take place right here on the Founders Club level. This is going to be the very first time that Arrowhead Stadium is going to be used as a voting location. Kansas City, Missouri residents but are in parts of Jackson County can cast their vote here. Any Jackson County resident outside of Casey Mo will have to go to their typically assigned voting location. You know, Tyron Matthew and Patrick Mahomes have been very outspoken about the importance of registering to vote and showing up on election day. So the 15 and the Mahomes Foundation partnered with Kansas City Election Board to make this event happen. The Kansas City Area Transportation Authority, they are also joining in, offering free bus services to and from the stadium. Now, they anticipate a lot of people showing up here to vote. So coming up here in our next half hour, we're going to talk about all of the safety precautions that the Chiefs organization and Arrowhead Stadium staff are doing to make sure everyone is safe on November 3rd. Reporting live at Arrowhead, Savannah Rudisell, KCTV 5 News. All right. Very interesting, Savannah. Thank you so much. A lot to do this weekend. Mm -hmm. Busy weekend there. 5